Well, hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Factorio. And this is our New World series. And let's carry on with what we're doing. So, basically, we've decided that within our suit here, we have this thing. And this thing's pretty useless. So, I think I'm going to make some more batteries. That way, we have better storage. Maybe build some more of these guys. Um, 24 kilowatts. So we could probably build one more of these and then two batteries. So maybe let's check that out. So grab your drink and your tasty treats and come join me for a ride. Uh, let's see here. So let's build another shield system. And we need to build 20 batteries. So we need more battery batteries. So let's drop off this, this stuff here. And we still got some ore on us. So let's run up here and so this looks a lot better now it's a lot more filled up let's throw this ore into here okay now we've got the energy shield let's pick up some let's see where are we here I want to pick up some batteries Do another stack. Perfect. Let's do that. Okay. Um, yeah, we're not making any more. That's interesting, but that's okay. We'll do that. Um, let's see here. So now we can make any more steel plates. It's kind of what we're we need. Let's stand here as we bring in some steel plates. Okay, uh, let's just keep doing that. Oh, almost there. Ah, there we go. So we want two more of these guys, right? One, two. Okay, while well, that's crafting, we can right click on these. Let's install this since we can have more shields. And then the two new batteries will go here, and then I think we'll have more capacity. This is slowly recharging because of the, uh, let's see here if I right click. So, five kilowatts. I think we'll be okay though, because with these, these shields, the way I expect them to work is these batteries are what will, will help fuel them, right? Yeah, I think that's kind of the plan, and that's why I want to put more batteries, so that way there's more shields, so that way we can withstand more hits. That's kind of the plan, because we need to take out that base over there. So, in anticipation of that, uh, what can we build that uses up that rod? One of those? Okay, let's run up here, let's drop off the these things here. Since we have a whole bunch. Okay. We can drop off those legs there. We'll use them in the next suit with the power plant. I think once we have a power plant, it'll be a lot easier, a lot better to work with. Let's throw those in here. Perfect. Let's throw the copper cable in here. Okay, let's throw the wood in here. Let's grab some bullets. Before, uh, like so, maybe. Maybe a little more. So we want that to keep going, right? Now we drew on here, so that's why there's less steel coming down the way here, uh, which is fine. We need to increase the oil production, unfortunately. So let's run it up here. I should have grabbed some more. Uh, uh, I should have grabbed some more of this stuff down here, the the uh, the cement stuff, because we need to start using this up before all the this the iron ore is gone. So let's kind of just place. up here 
it. Do it like this. Okay, perfect. Uh, what's this? Oh, that's just iron stick. It's running up here. So this is basically Kaputski, Kaputski. Still got some resources here. Okay. So this one's done. This one's done. Okay. Um, we can probably pick these guys up. Pick that up. I think like that. We can just keep it like that. That should be okay. These are all filled up. We'll have to dispose of those in some way. Okay, and now these guys, where are they? Right here. Should be a fairly easy base to take out. Let's put a couple turrets here. Shift 4. So let's see what, what all comes at us. Whew. Come on, boys. Yeah, don't get me. Okay. Let's do this. Okay, pick these guys up. Okay, let's proceed over. Okay, perfect. Of course they're going to attack. That's why does it have to be easy, right? Ah! Okay, just gonna make sure. Okay, perfect. Uh, medium worm. Okay, that worked out really good using the hot keys there. I went a little bit quiet, but that is to be expected. Let's just repair these guys up. Okay. And uh, shift four. Shift three. See, so they're hitting me, but I'm recharging, so this is perfect. Uh, let's shoot this guy. Perfect. We don't have to move. There you go. Okay, so that's this one taken care of. Perfect. Okay, let's repair this bugger here. Okay, so that's awesome. So that went w quite well, actually. So the hotkeys is definitely the way it is. Um, definitely the way it is. Oh, and our inventory is full. Well, sort of. We need to repair that. So that way... That has that. Oh, look at that. I think they fixed that. They must have updated the game. I think it's 12.10 now. And uh, before you had to always switch out these things, but now it looks like it automatically uh, fixes it, which is awesome. We have these passive chests we need to place everywhere. Oh, here we go. So we're going to put these batteries in place. So we're, we're going to lose a lot of power, but that's only because of these guys, because it's solar power. So. Yeah, um, and it's not su sunny yet, so yeah. So let's take a quick peek at their map here. Okay, so I think we should be okay with the biters, so we'll be able to focus on getting some more oil to our place. Which means we might have to campaign down into here, because we see this deposit here. And maybe I'll ship it up with train and then unload it in here somewhere. Maybe unload it down here at the bottom. Hmm. Let's take a kind of peek at that. Let's kind of run and take a... I know there's two There's two oil deposits down here. So the copper we can tap into at one point. Yeah, I think definitely we're going to start thinking about trains. Look at what's this. This is an iron deposit. Huh. Look at that. Let's we'll see about clearing that up. Uh, right down here somewhere. Uh, right here. I'm standing on it. Let's check this out. Oh yeah, look, there we go. There's an oil deposit. Is it just the one? 
Um, so if I go map, no, there's two here. Right here is another one. Okay, here we go. Let's clear some trees up. These nice, beautiful trees. Okay. Oh yeah, of course we're full. We can't pick up anything. Look at that. You can see the wood there on the ground here. <laughs> That's okay. Let's run over this way then. And um, how do we unload some stuff? Maybe some bullets. Maybe we got, we got too many bullets. Run through this stuff here. I'll definitely want to check on the outpost down below there at one point. Should still be okay, but you never know. The map, where can we put radar units? Maybe we'll extend the radar. Maybe we'll put radar here, here, along the top, and along the side. Maybe. Sounds like a plan, right? Um, oil here. Tiny deposit there. Is that oil or is that copper? I think that's copper. Right here though, here there's a lot of oil. And then there's some more down there. Um, there's oil up here, a couple. Just really small ones unfortunately. So, hmm. Need to think about this. Let me throw that in there. Let's run over this way. And let's throw some bullets back. Yeah, I'll just throw some bullets back here. Like so. so we, have, we have some room. And then. Okay. Let's see here. And then we can grab some of this stuff. Um. Since we're carrying it, we might as well grab some accumulators, and we might as well grab some of these guys as well. That way we have some, since we're using the slots. Okay, so now, now we need to think about, so we need to get oil, so we need a couple derricks. Because um, I need more steel. Which means it's going to take from that, which is fine. Let's pick up a bunch of steel here. I need a couple of these pump jacks. Then I need to build those pumps, the uh, these pumps here. So, I don't think I have any regular engines. Or any of these electric engines. So let's go into here. We do need to expand the roboports. That's another thing we need to do. So let's go up here. Where's the roboports? Need to grab those. That produce more roboports. And I need to grab. Hmm. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Okay, perfect. Um, and then. One, two, three, four. So four pumps. Okay, so we, we're making pump jacks, pumps, um, we need pipes. So basically what we need to do is we need to do passive provider. And what these chests do is if you place them, for example, in key places, like right here we put passive provider. So this will provide these things to anything that needs it in the logistic system and we're going to do the same with ammo here all right we want to make sure we have access to ammo because why not um what else do we want here maybe access to the concrete access to those okay perfect um Okay, let's go fix the, our, our issue here. We need pipes, pipes, pipes. Where are we? Over here. Uh, let's actually grab a full stack. Okay, now let's go and figure some pipe stuff out. Let's do this. As 
we you know, use this stuff. Okay, I'm glad these are all operating as expected. Yeah, looks like performance available for performance. So, are the accumulators working? In conjunction. Let's take a quick peek at this. Ah, see. I don't know how to get rid of this part so it doesn't use the steam engines, it uses the accumulators over the steam engines. I might have to create some sort of system for that. Maybe some wiring, I'm not too sure. Okay, where's the oil deposits? Over here somewhere. Okay. Why is there power? Oh yeah, power goes up there from down there. Hmm. Okay, so we need to place our two pump jacks. Like so. Okay, and then we need to make sure we have these guys powered. Um, so we want something like that. And then we want a light. And then we want something like this. Just a string. How far are we to here? There, and then one more, I think. Maybe it's like in that spot, I think, right here. Seems to have the most connections. Okay, beautiful. I think that will do it. Let's make sure we put a light in the corner of each of these guys. That's something I want to do, just to make sure so that way we always have available lighting. Okay, so we got those, those put in there like that. So now if we do something like that this and this we bring that like that okay maybe you do electric pump like so I think right um, let's put another wire here and then oh let me just go do one like that and go underground. Like so. How far can we go, you think, down the line here? Let's see here. Hmm. Like that. Let's do, let's keep the pipe on the outside. I think that's what's going to happen. Well, not on the outside, but I just need to hook it in somewhere. Um, maybe we can bring the pipe down along this way here. Kind of in behind. Here's the oil right here. Maybe we can do it on the outside. So I don't think they attack anyways. So like that. And then we need to put a pump in there. Like so. Okay. Then I think we can bring these backwards. Okay, uh, we need to take this tree out. Yeah, we'll just do it just on the outside. They'll be fine, the pipes. Like that. Let's just pick this up. Okay, um, yeah, I know that that's flashing. Personal RoboPort. Ooh, this is exciting. We do have to research that. Definitely. So let's get this in order. 
Yeah, we'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens with the pipe. If it gets disconnected, we'll just have to reconnect it. Not a big deal. Do this. Just keep laying down pipe all the way down to the end. Actually, it might work out fine where it is. Just looking at it now, and yeah, I think we'll be okay. The turrets will be able to protect anything. Yeah, this will be this will be good. This will be a quick injection of of oil, which will go through like nothing. Um, but that's fine and dandy. Let's see here, like that, like that. Actually, doing pretty good with the trees, surprisingly. Okay, and. Like that, I think. Yeah, okay. And then we bring this down. Like so. And then I think we put the pipe like that. And, ah, uh, come on. Just need to make sure that other pump is powered. Um, let's see here. Yeah, right here it goes up. Right, and goes up this way, and there'll be a pump right here. So let us bring in some power. Maybe just use this thing, and then put a light in place. Okay, bang! I think see it's pushing. You can see it flowing, which is beautiful. And I think this thing. Yeah, I think it's flowing in that direction too. Good, good, good. Okay. Excellent. So now we need to put a flashlight, or flashlight light here. Okay. Now let's check the oil. Should be a visible, noticeable change. We should see more plastic potentially being created. I um, guess you can... See, it's flowing slow again here, so we need more engines. So, let's see here. Let's put the one right here. And then put power to this. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, maybe, maybe, but the problem maybe with this is it's being pushed in too quickly. Well, actually, they're both... So it did kind of kick up a little bit. More is being created. But you know what's going to happen, of course. It's going to be very slow. See this bubble slowly going over. Hmm. Almost need a pump like this. Um, and then just do regular pipe and then do power. Ah, it looks like it's working as it's expected. Don't have any light oil. Got a bunch of heavy oil and sulfuric. So we're still doing okay with all this stuff. Um, yeah, I don't know. Well, no, see this has increased a bit. So those two wells have significantly increased production for temporarily. Which is nice. Um, we have to go down here, unfortunately. So that means we're going to have to make a campaign. We have to go through all of these biters. So I think that'll be it for this episode, and then the next episode we're gonna get uh, we're gonna kind of get ready for war here and, and go from there. So thank you everybody for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye bye.